Hey, what's up, everybody? It's 2A Libertarian here, and check it out. I have a holster for my PSA dagger. But before we get into this review, go ahead and follow me on IG at 2A Libertarian. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Smash that like, and uh, let's get into it. But um, I just want to thank everybody who already subscribed, and uh, you guys are the reason why I keep doing this. Um, I love uh, waking up, seeing new subscribers. I love seeing positive uh, feedback. And, uh, you know, that stuff is greatly appreciated. So I want to just give a huge thank you to those guys who already did that. Um, let's keep this thing going. So about a week ago, I reached out to uh, Triad Holsters. I needed a holster for my uh, PSA dagger because there's little to no options out there for these things. Uh, they are a fairly new firearm. And, um, you know, there's not a lot of options. So when I reached out to them, the owner <laughs> responded within an hour, you guys. And uh, he goes, we can do that. And uh, so it happens he had a dagger himself. Um, There's not a lot of options for these things, like I said. So when I reached out, I wasn't expecting um, a quick response. But uh, this is what I got, man. And I am impressed. Uh, when he made the holster, when he was in the process of making it, he asked me, he said, hey, man, what colors do you like? And I said, you know what? Do whatever, do whatever you want, you know. I just want a badass holster. And uh, he goes, how about lone wolf carbon fiber? And, you know, I've never had a lone wolf gray uh, holster. So I'm like, you know, I'll try it. Let's go for it. And when I got this thing in the mail, I mean, this thing is art, man. I'm loving it. But uh, before we go ahead and get into this full review, for you range safety officers on YouTube, this thing is clear. Nothing in the mag nothing in the chamber you know come on you guys common sense uh, a lot of people always ask me why do you use gloves when you do your reviews well because I don't like leaving smudges on you know things I'm reviewing um, you know that's just kind of my thing it's a personal thing um, I don't want to show you guys something nice and there's a big fingerprint all over it you know and smudges all over it from the you know, gun oil or something you know I don't like that but um let's get into this but um Man, I, I'm actually feeling this holster here. I wore it for two days, and um, it's comfortable as hell. It has um, the claw. It has your uh, Triad branded clip. That's a nice touch there. Um, you know, when companies add their brand or their name to a holster, this kind of makes the holster feel or become more premium because, you know, they put the time into doing something like that. And uh, it just makes it feel personable, you know. Um, one thing I did notice is that it has this little cutout here. And, um, you know, for you guys who uh, shoot your guns a lot and you holster them a lot, like me, I go to the range, I put, you know, a couple hundred rounds to this thing and I put it back in a holster. And, uh, you know, you you know when you put a, a hot gun in your holster, uh, you can kind of feel the holster kind of warming up. Um, so this slit right here is like ventilation. It cools the barrel down, cools the slide down. And, uh, you know, that right there is like an added touch to this holster. Um, I actually love that. But uh, when you put this thing in the uh, holster, you see it covers up the mag release, which is a huge plus for me because you don't want to have one of those oops moments where you draw your gun and you hit the mag release on accident and boom, your mag falls out. And if you're going to use it for self-defense and you want your mag, you don't want your mag just like dumping out in a self-defense moment. So um, it's a great thing there. Um, with this holster, I did notice something. I'm not sure if this will work, but I might try it. Um, it looks like there's going to be enough room for me to add my Romeo Zero. I don't know if I'm picking that up, but it looks like there's going to be enough room for me to add a Romeo Zero and still keep the same holster. Um only time will tell. We'll see. But uh, so far, I'm feeling this thing. And the best thing about it, made in USA, baby. If you go to their website, they offer holsters for different uh, firearms. Like I said, this is the Achilles line of the uh, PSA dagger. They also offer offer a uh, Zeus line. But uh, they offer holsters for several different firearms, such as Glock, H&K, um, your SIGs, your Smith & Wesson, your Springfields, your Zev Techs, you know, 
pretty much all the major brands that are out there, they offer a holster for it. But I can say I'm the only one. I think there's two. The owner has the Lone Wolf Gray. But we're the only two with this color for the Achilles line, and I'm loving it. But for the Achilles line, you do get some great options. You have black, Coyote Tan, and FDE. And uh, I'm just feeling this thing, you guys. So let me know what you guys think. Check them out. Try it, holsters.com. And uh, this thing is dope. I can't wait to go wear it some more. You guys, take it easy. God bless. Huge thank you to everyone who already subscribed. You have an awesome day.